Hello, um, welcome to my YouTube channel. This is gonna be my first video. It has nothing to do with Waluigi, but it's just a review video. So, I'm gonna unbox the Posable Zeraora plush. Zeraora is one of my favorite Pokemon. So, this is gonna be really cool. Oh yeah, and also the Sin and Cutie Toxicroak plush. I heard that it's mostly printed. So first we're gonna start with the Zero Aura. It's a bit small, but at least it's small enough. And these are official from the Pokemon Center website. Zero Aura is very soft. He's posable, you can pose his arms. That's really cool. They have like a wire in them. I don't know if you can pose his legs. He has a little bit of printed on color, which I don't really like that much, but most of his body is stitched. He feels really soft. You can pose him really cool. Like they did this pose on the Pokemon Center website. It's a bit hard to pose because he has small arms, but he's pretty cool. So there's his little tab. So yeah, Zero Aura, pretty cool, pretty cool plush. Now, I'm gonna unbox the Toxicroak plush. There's also these Zero bags in there, but I don't care about those. Toxicroak is almost the size of the Zero Aura. I just kinda let down because he's the same kitty, which are the smallest plushies. So, there's the boy, y'all. He sits. He's kind of cute, I guess. His little ribbit thingy is really soft. It's kind of squishy, I guess. I don't like the fact that... Well, I like most of the red on him is actually, like, soft and it's not printed. But half his, almost all of his body is printed. So that's kind of a lead down. He has the same tag. Toxicroak. He's also a pretty cool plush. I think I like the Zero Aura better. I put on my mouth actually. Because he's a lot more better. I think he might have came out. Yeah, he came out first. And then they released the Sinnoh, Sinning Cuties. I don't like this guy that much. He's kind of cute. At least he sits. There you go. This is okay. At least this part also isn't printed. This part isn't printed, and this part isn't printed. Most of the red and his little hair thingy isn't printed. But his feet, the little his little red toe, isn't is actually printed, which is kind of bad. He's awfully worn. His yeah, I forgot his also this part, his little back ball thing isn't printed either, so that's cool. I rate this Zero Aura uh, an eight out of ten. He's a pretty cool plush. It just maybe it should have not as much uh, printed on color like this, and also some of his hand is printed, like hair, and also his legs. Also, his tail, tail could be better. But I rate this guy, and also he could have been a bit bigger. But I rate this guy a 8 out of 10. Now, the Toxic Croak, on the other hand, I rate this guy 7 out of 10. He's not that good, but he sits. He's kind of cute. There's not that much printed, but there's still a lot of printed on color. He's not that, he's, his feet are kind of weird. Just, it's kind of weird. He's kind of weird. He's a bit, he's kind of cool. But this thing is kind of fun to switch, squish. It's a bit firm though. So they kind of made this plush a lot better. They can make this plush a little bit better. But yeah, that is my review on the 
Zara Aura Posable Plush and the top and the Sin and Cutie Toxic Rose Blush. See you in the next video.